back to my channel and this week's video I will be showing you a school survival kit that every person needs because it is necessary. So let's hop right into the video. Okay, so first you're gonna need is a bag. I took this bag that I have, it's a makeup bag, it's called Makeup Geek and it's really cute and I would suggest doing a bag that doesn't look like anything suspicious, maybe something that is not clear, not nothing see-through. This just looks like you got makeup in it, like because it says Makeup Geek, so people are just going to assume that there's makeup in here when there's not. There's not, there's none. Actually there is, but yeah. First thing in your bag that you will need is a hair tie. Hair ties for you, for you people with long hair, you're going to need a hair tie because it gets hot, especially here in California. It gets hot. And probably other parts of the world. It's probably really hot in other parts of the world, too. But here in California, it's super hot right now. It's over 100, like, almost every day. So, you, when you see it, throw your hair up because you're getting sweaty and gross. You don't want your hair on your body. No, no, no. So, a hair tie is a must. I usually keep hair ties on my wrists. But if you're not one of those people that want that, then just throw it in your bag. The next thing is gum. Or mints. If you like, if you're more, if you're a... Uh, if you're more of a mint person, then you can do mints, but I'm more of a gum person. So gum is necessary also because you don't want your breath smelling, especially after you eat lunch. You know, just throw a pop of mint or a pop piece of gum. People will thank you. The next thing I have in here is a comb or a hairbrush. I couldn't find a small hairbrush. I just have a small comb. So here's a comb so you can like just brush out tangles in your hair or, you know, you just feel a little frilly. So you just go, oh, you just go it's it's like it's easy you can just it's simple just brush your hair you know people's hair gets messy especially when it gets windy outside just brush it down so you don't look like you just got electrocuted is chapstick chapstick is also a must because when it gets colder outside and a little more windy your lips tend to get really dry so it's always nice to just have chapstick on hand to make them not dry and moisturized the next thing I have is ibuprofen. Now, if you're not an ibuprofen person, you can obviously have like Advil or all the other medications. Now, I don't know about your school, but my school, we're not allowed to have that. We're not allowed to have that with you. So if you're not allowed to have ibuprofen or any other medications on you, then just take it to the office and put it in there and say, hey, I might need this today. School gives me headaches. So just go put it in the office and then I'm sure you can just go down and pop some in your mouth if you need it. The next thing is lotion. I have this little mini size lotion because that's also necessary. If your hands are feeling dry, you don't feel like dry hands. That's just annoying. So you get some lotion, put some on your arms, put some on your hands. Maybe take your feet out and just put them on your feet. You never know. The next thing is tissues. Tissues are also necessary, especially when it's springtime allergy season and you get like runny noses those are also very necessary the next thing is deodorant you do not want to be smelling you do not want to be smelling okay you got to use deodorant especially if you have pee if you have pee bring deodorant please bring deodorant nobody wants to smell your stink the next thing is a tampon or a pad Either or, whatever you're comfortable with, bring one just in case for you ladies out there. You might start your period at school. And what if you don't have anything? What are you supposed to do? So always keep it on hand, even if you're not on your period. Always keep it on hand because you never know. And also, you could be that cool person in the bathroom when someone's like, oh crap, I don't have a tampon or I don't have a pad. And you're like, oh, I got you, girl, I got you. And you just whip it out and they'll thank you forever. Literally, not even joking. They will be your best friend. They'll be like... You saved me. You saved me, girl. And they'll be like, I got you, girl. Now, the last thing that I have in my bag is powder. Now, I would suggest using oil-absorbing sheets instead, but I don't have any. So, But powder is just, like, the next best thing. This is to, like, if you have any shine. If you're one of those people that shine a lot and get really oily skin, this will just clear it up. I don't have that, so I don't really worry about this problem. But, you know, you just plop it on your face. Everyone think you're really cool. And like you're in a movie and you're just like da 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 da. So that's it in my bag. There's obviously probably hundreds of other things that you can throw in your bag that is necessary for you and to keep you surviving during school. Which I believe me, I know it's hard. I'm a senior. I've been through it. I'm still going through it. <laughs> 
Um, so I, so I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give this video a big thumbs up. And if you want to see more videos from me in the future, don't forget to subscribe down below. I hope you guys all enjoyed and I'll see you all next Saturday. Bye!